Welcome to auditory illusion number two. You're going to need a pair of headphones. Just before we listen to this week's illusion, consider this optical illusion. You might have seen this before. You're asked to stare intently at the dot in the center of the image. Then, after some time, the image is going to change. When the scene does change, it reverts to a black and white photograph. And even though there are no colors present in this image, it looks as though there are. This is something called the after image effect. And we're gonna try and create a similar phenomena, but using sound. I advise that you wear headphones and try and minimize background noise. And as a word of warning, the sound clip is gonna last for 20 seconds and it's gonna be quite loud. So here we go. If the illusion was successful, you should have heard a faint ringing sound after the noise stopped. Similar to that that you would get if you attend a loud rock concert, and then when you go outside, you've got this lingering aftertone. This after effect tends to last somewhere between one second and six seconds, depending on how long you listen to the noise for. It's been described as a unique illusion because the phenomena cannot be explained by the known properties of the auditory periphery alone. So what is it that creates the illusion? Here's a spectrum of the noise you were just listening to. The deep roaring sound had frequencies below 880 Hertz and the high hiss was random noise with frequencies above 3520 Hertz. In the middle is this spectral gap and it's in this spectral gap that the zwicker tone appears. That's the name given to that strange audio after effect. We're gonna to listen to another audio sample. And this time what I've done is to shift the spectral gap. I may have shifted it to the right to higher frequencies, or maybe I shifted it to the left to lower frequencies. By listening to the Zwicker tone, you should be able to tell which way the spectral gap was moved. So here we go. Did you hear the Zwicker tone? Was it higher than before or lower than before? Leave your answer in the comments below. And if you want to check to find out whether you're right, have a look in the video description. Tune in next time for another Auditory Illusion.